A shop owner in Long Beach is demanding more action by the city after a series of crashes. Two cars have crashed into Magnolia and Willow in the past month, and the most recent being over the weekend. Eyewitness News reporter Sophie Flay is live in Long Beach with more. Sophie? Colleen Ellen, I am standing on the corner of Willow Street and Magnolia Avenue, and as you can probably see, it is a very busy intersection. And the owner of that antique store says car crashes here happen monthly, increasing safety concerns, costing them thousands of dollars. A dramatic video shows a car smashing into the store window of Magnolia and Willow in Long Beach. Emily Yep, the co-owner of this antique store on Willow Street, says car crashes at this intersection happen monthly, costing them thousands of dollars. I'm fearful every day someone's going to be hurt. Clips of the car shared on social media stuck in the front of the building. The license plate still sitting in the wall of the store. That window has been boarded up since the crash over 4th of July weekend, reminding folks that this is not a, quote, drive through shopping experience. And on Saturday, another crash careened a car into the store's front door. We get close calls almost all the time, and I think we hear them, and like our first initial reaction is like, <gasps> we hear like honking, and we're like, oh no, like what's going on? Is something going to happen? The owner says she's been reaching out to city officials for help since 2017, with no luck so far. But today, the owner of 1 800 Bollards offering to assist. Offer to provide us with all the Bollards we need if we can just get the city to approve them being installed and get them installed. Long Beach Public Works officials say that they are designing traffic improvements and working on safety measures. Hello, I'm Mark Brown. Get more great ABC7 content by clicking the subscribe button for our YouTube channel. And download the ABC7 Los Angeles streaming app on Fire TV, Android TV, Apple TV, and Roku to watch on your TV.